How's it going everyone? Um, this is just a quick video um, that I wanted to share with you all about green spot algae. Um, pretty much all of us suffer from green spot algae at some point or another. Um, on your glass you'll see um, some green hard spots uh, which tend to, to spread quite quickly. You'll see them on slow growing plants like anubias. Um, one way to tackle this is with um, potassium phosphate. Um, if you dose EI fertilizers in your tank then you'll use this anyway um, but if you still suffer from green spot algae then you want to double your dose because um, this is very effective against green spot algae. Uh, if you use one of the pre-mixed mainstream fertilizers then I recommend getting some uh, potassium phosphate um, and dosing that additionally as well. Um, I'll give you an idea of dosing uh, this was my original mix that I used to use um, when I first started using um, EI fertilizers. Uh, I added t 6 teaspoons of potassium nitrate, 2 teaspoons of potassium phosphate and 12 teaspoons of magnesium sulfate. I've now doubled my potassium phosphate to 4 teaspoons um, and I dose 10 ml per 50 litre. Um, if you don't want to mix up a dosing bottle um, then you can always add the salt dry to the tank. Um, you can use a one teaspoon measuring spoon, you can use uh, a, a normal medicine spoon. Uh, the larger size is 5 mil and the smaller size is 2.5 mil. Um, the 5 mil is the same size as a teaspoon, um, so one teaspoon it equals 5 mil. You can also get things like one mil uh, measuring spoons and then you can just adjust accordingly. But what you want to do is add um, a quarter of a teaspoon um, of potassium phosphate every other day um, and go from there. Leave it a few weeks, keep, keep adding your um, potassium phosphate and after a few weeks if there's any change then you're going down the right path, um, stick to that. If you don't see much change at all, then increase your potassium phosphate a bit more. Um, it won't do any damage to your tank um, and it should eradicate um, or at least keep the green spot algae under control. Um, you need to remember that you need to keep everything balanced in your tank, so you need to have good CO2, good uh, water flow um, and keep your light into um, a nice balanced level because um, that, that's, that's what your tanks need, tanks need, they need balance. Uh, so uh, add some potassium phosphate, a quarter of a teaspoon every other day, or as I say, pre-mixed um, in your EI salts um, mixture. Um, double your dose um, if you still suffer from it. If you need to get hold of this, if you haven't got any, um, in the UK you can go to aquariumplantfood.co.uk um, and I believe in the US uh, there's a company called uh, Greenleaf Aquariums. Um, I'll find out the proper link um, and if you go down the bottom there you'll see a show more button. Click the show more button and you'll find the links to the companies on there. Um, and I'll put a brief summary of this video including the, the dosings um, I think you should use. Um, but let me know how you get on. Um, if you do suffer from green spot, I could take a, a video of your tank now take one in a few weeks time um, and let me know how you get on. You can leave them as video responses, you can leave me comments, um, it's not a problem at all. Um, I'll accept anyone uh, who submits videos or comments that um, are going to help the community um, share their experiences. Um, give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Uh, there's going to be a lot more coming, I'm going to be doing quite a few quick blog videos. Um, so thank you very much for watching. Um, and uh, I'll see you later. Bye.